Years ago, we had a circumstance in a fellowship, and it was really bad. And I had a party a couple of years ago, birthday party, my annual birthday party. Everybody comes so I can see my wife be overwhelmed. I'm just kidding a little bit, but it happens. And we've had as many as 100, 120 people come to that party. Well, one person came to that party a couple of years ago and they said, do you ever hear from so-and-so? And I said, yeah, I talk to him two or three times a week. If he listens, you have gained a brother. See, the body of Christ, we can say, I don't like that person. I don't want to be around that person. But that's like taking your arm and seeing if you can throw it off you. It really doesn't work quite like that. It's still there. You can hide it behind your back and go, I don't have any hands, but they're still operative. We can take people and disregard them in the hope that maybe they'll come around or we just can avoid the circumstance. But that doesn't always work. James 5, 19, 20, 19 through 20 says, My brothers, if one of you should wander from the truth and someone